10, this drag show stirring up controversy tonight at UW Fox Valley. Student fees are being used to pay for part of it, and one group believes that sort of entertainment has no place on a college campus. NBC 26's Jonathan Gregg is live in Menasha tonight with more. Jonathan? Stacy, Julaine Appleen is the president of the Wisconsin Family Action. She wrote on an online blog that this drag show is disgusting, decidedly unwholesome, and pushes a dangerous homosexual agenda. Very strong words that didn't stop the show from having a sellout crowd. If you're not familiar, a drag show is a flamboyant performance of men impersonating women. Shangela is the show's featured act. She knows not everybody is a fan. When people critique, whether it's my show or events that I'm part of, I just invite them to come, see the show themselves, and then walk away with their opinion. UW Fox Valley's Campus Activity Board schedules this and many other events on campus. It's run by students. So this was something that was uh, initiated by the students. University Relations Director Dave Hager, not shocked by the comments from Wisconsin Family Action, disappointed is the word he uses. Some people may think that this is stretching the point of diversity, uh, it really is encouraging diversity. When a Seattle-based columnist and LGBT advocate read about Appling calling the show shameful, he reacted, buying out the rest of the show and giving the tickets away to students. In small towns or in high schools and colleges, are being bullied by elected officials or just freelance right-wing conservative bigots. Appling says she's not backing down, though declining an interview and releasing a statement saying, Wisconsin Family Action stands by our statements earlier this week. We do not believe this show is in any way in the students' best interest. Menasha police were hanging out as fans were arriving, but said they didn't have any problems. Reporting live in Menasha, Jonathan Gregg, NBC 26.